Hello everyone, I am Zia and welcome to my channel Learning Turn. Yes, my fun hut is now Learning Turn, Smart Turn to Knowledge. Today's topic is how to measure rainfall with a rain gauge. So let's learn something new today. Rainfall is a needed resource since it provides water to plants, fills rivers and provides fresh water. When rainfall is long and heavy, it can lead to rapid flooding which is dangerous for the nearby population. A much needed step to better understand this natural phenomenon is to properly measure it. It turns out to be pretty tricky because rainfall is extremely variable in time and space. The most common rainfall measurement is the total rainfall depth during a given period expressed in millimeters. What is a rain gauge? The standard instrument for the measurement of rainfall is the 8 inch rain gauge. This is essentially a circular funnel with a diameter of 2 not 3 millimeters which collects the rain into a calibrated cylinder. The top of the rain gauge is 0.3 meters above the ground. Rain gauge model for this activity, you will need a plastic bottle, tape, a pair of scissors and a paper cutter. So let's start. Take the bottle and cut off the upper part 10 cm from the top. Then open the cap, turn it upside down on top of the bottle to create a sort of a funnel. Now stick it with some tape. Stick a ruler on the side of the bottle. I don't have a 10 cm ruler so I am making measurements on a paper and then sticking it. Our rain gauge is now ready. I have made another one for my school project. Fill the bottle with water up to the zero mark on the ruler, which should be above the bumps at the bottom of the bottle. The bumps would otherwise affect the measurement. Bring your rain gauge outside as far as possible from buildings and trees. Here I have placed it on my rooftop. Note the water level after one hour. If you plan to take your measurements during the summer, some of the water inside the bottle will evaporate and this will affect your measurements. To avoid this, you can add a thin layer of oil to the water to prevent evaporation. The measurements you get from the rain gauge will tell you how much rainfall has occurred over a certain period of time. Here I have recorded 5 mm of rainfall. If you enjoyed the video, like, subscribe, share and click the notification so you don't miss out on more fun and educational videos. Thanks for watching. Bye.